Most people in West Hartford are struggling without power. Thank goodness most of the eateries on Park Road are still open. Very busy. We have been running around, but I think people is very happy that we have been here, we have been open, and we have electricity. It's great. We came here because it's warm and we have lights and there's food, and something hot to eat, basically. Yeah. So these are family and friends. Well, I've actually been very lucky. Our electricity came back on. Um, Sunday morning at about 10 o'clock, so I've actually felt guilty. So I've kind of opened up the doors to anybody who wants to come, take showers, and be, have some heat, watch some television, and because uh, I feel guilty that, that we got our power back on so quickly. Since the, since the loss of power, it's been uh, no breaks. It's just people just keep coming and coming and coming. Yeah. Which we don't mind. <laughs> Hello, so how has it been without power? It's been very cold, but it's, uh, and today I, we had to empty out our freezer because it's, we had to throw all the food away. So we're here at uh, Effie's place because they have good food and we needed a bowl of soup and a hot coffee and tea. So, how, how long have you been without power? Um, I've been without power since Saturday night, and my mom over in New Britain has been without since uh, four days. Four, four days. days without any power. Yeah. So I came over to my daughter to stay with her because she has a gas fireplace, and it warms up the house. Otherwise, you know, no electricity. There's nothing like Chinese food when the power's out. Uh, everybody around here doesn't have any power except for our little street here on Park Road and uh, people have been coming in for a hot meal, staying a little longer to, to stay warm and then going home. Spirits. How are their spirits? Actually they're very happy. Um, a lot of them bring their friends and they come and have a nice meal and it's a, it's a way to get together that you, typically when you don't have time to get together that uh, you have the chance to do it now. The owner of Los Ab Abodas tells us that they've been busy as well. Yes. So, how has it been without having power? Oh, jeez. Well, you know, uh, it's this is the way it must have been uh, 200 or 150 years ago, right? <laughs> where we've got fireplaces, and uh, you know, we're uh, you know we're living, uh, you know, it's, uh, we're making the best of it. So. How long have you been without power? Since Saturday at 10.30. And uh, so we've been doing a lot of eating out. Uh, right guys? Yeah. A lot of eating out. So. Local residents have been trying to make the best of what they can out of the power outage. Eateries have certainly been helping. For Be The Media, I'm Brennan. And I'm Mike Ray.